wonder what Mr. What business Mr. Carmi has to take care of. Hmm. Well, of course. Warm afternoon rays of light fell from the sky. Emily and Axel were making their way down the main street toward the river towers Carmia had called for them. What's wrong, Axel? Axel didn't respond. Instead, he crouched down where he stood. He picked a piece of paper off the ground and stood back. Oh, okay, we're heading into the trash section. That's, uh, interesting. I thought maybe that was, we were heading into something new other than the fact that, you know, we just had a strange, cuddly moment with that. Hello, Mr. Kami and Curie. <sighs> Oh, right, they're getting a drink. And again, he's like, you get your own damn drink. Rude. And now we're talking about the festival. Yay! Hmm. I don't seem to have that option of what they're suggesting in the thing. So let me just save really quick. Because the option tells me sounds fun, but I don't see an option for sounds fun here. The most I can see is I can't wait. So I guess it will be I can't wait then? Oh wait, I see. I, According to this thing, I guess I don't have to worry about these other chapters. Okay, so I guess it will be... I can't wait! A lot of shops will be participating, right? I can't wait! Woo! This is gonna be exciting! We're gonna have a festival! My perspective, are you sure? Yay! We're gonna do more stuff, and we're gonna have a fun time! Oh. oh, is this where he suggests a, uh, a river fountain? A chocolate river? That would be awesome still. I'm still very much in favor of that. It would take a ridiculous amount of time to do. We're not Willy Wonka, but I would... Ooh. Hang on, let me load that again. Because I, I misclicked a little too fast there. So, click on the... I can't wait. Okay. I guess it must be th that's too bad because I don't see the other option here. Yeah, I'm looking. I don't see that option, which is weird. Okay, that's why I was skipping a thing. I am losing... I, I was skipping around a bit too much. Okay, now I figured out. That's too bad, I was right. That's too bad, Axel. I know, I thought it was a good idea too, but I can't say that in game. Oh, here we go. We're jumping into uh, our confrontation, confrontation with Caesar, even though he's not my romance option in this one. So, let's skip past this, and they're like, ah, I will come after you the day of the festival. Okay, now I actually know where I'm at in this. <laughs> I don't know always what I'm doing, that's fine. <sighs> okay. So... Let's see what happens next.
Because I'm, like, getting pretty close here to a good chunk. I kind of want to see what happens a little further in. You're here, Mr. Carmia. Hmm, nothing in particular. I just wanted to see you. Oh, are you busy? Oh, okay. What's up? Really? As she watched him shuffle through the papers on his desk, she couldn't help but be curious. What kind of work are you doing today? Um, gambling? Excuse me? He nodded, patting one of the stacks of papers on the desk. Hmm. Okay. Sounds fun! <laughs> Sounds like fun. Can I play too? Money. Um, I still have some left over. Only a little, though. I'm sure you would have done the exact same thing if she told you about her awful, how awful her life was. Huh? How'd you know? Oh. But she was crying. Oh. I'm gullible. Um, yeah. That's the thing. Mark? Marco Polo? Mr. Curry would help me out? Ah. Okay. Well, to be fair, he's the scarecrow, so he would have a brain. You're more the courage, dude. Psychological warfare? カードってのは運は。That's fair. A weird expression, huh? Now I'm curious. Are you sure? <laughs> Cards. Ah, uh, I lost again. Carmia smiled sympathetically as he gathered the cards up from the table. Do not bet, girl. D just do not do the gambling thing. After stacking them back into a neat deck, he returned them to their box. You're the same, Mr. Carmia. He always starts smirking when you get good cards. <laughs> Yay! Would you play with me again? <laughs> Maybe I'll actually start getting better if I'm playing with you. Who knows? Ooh, pretty music, and now it's the day of the festival! That's... You usually take your job too seriously. I don't think we really need to have to be on guard, too on guard. It's not like I'm really being targeted in particular. Well, yes, but Mr. Caesar is the only one after me. No one else is going to do anything. It's fair. Hello, Mr. Carbian, Mr. Kiri. We're having some fun, right? Ooh, candy. Thank you very much. Mmm, it's delicious. Hmm? Why are you smiling? Poison? Uh, I swallowed it! Why poison? What? Mr. Carmius? Yeah? Ouch! I feel kind of exhausted from all this. Yeah, he, he really is. Oh, hello. Hi, Mr. Caesar! Are you going to have a nice fight? Okay, I'm gonna stand back. I'm just gonna... 
A duel? Okay, fine. Let's see what's, what's gonna happen then. This is so awkward. ボスとしてアバレンボーの狼ちゃんは見逃すわけにはいかないのさ。銃しか使えない弱虫の軟弱者が何を言っている。声。この剣で切り刻んでやろう。切り刻まれて喜ぶ趣味はないのでね。キリ
That special reason I just figured the more the merrier, right? Huh. Aww. That's sad. And then we're back here in this particular area. It's been a long time since we came here. Oh, hi, it's you again. And I can't skip past this because it's different. And so, yeah, we're all having the big group discussion about the festival stars and some like that. So, yeah, this is gonna be interesting. The shower gathering, that's right. So, we can all make wishes and it's all gonna be nice and romantic and cute and adorable and you're just gonna be so happy and in love and crap. Huh, your cookie again, Mr. Carmia? Ooh, we only just finished lunch. Ah, oh, that's that's fair. That's fair. Okay. I know, but I want to watch. I like watching you cook. Hmm? I mean, when you're in love, you have the strangest uh, things that you're like, oh my god, that's adorable kind of moments, so... Mr. Carmi is so good at this. He's so fast at chopping up the vegetables, and he seems to be very thoughtful about how he puts things in the pan. Compared to you, Mr. Carmi, I... Huh? It's not really bothering me. I was just thinking about what a good cook you are, Mr. Carmi. True. I mean, she's an amnesiac. I don't, we don't even know what she cooked beforehand. Really? <laughs> oh, are you sure? That's fair. That is fair. That is fair. I want to help. I guess I'll take you up on that offer. Hmm. He pulled the basket out of the cover and reached for the pile of vegetables on the counter. Putting a few of them into the basket, he slid it over to her. Oh, okay. Just trust her with cutting things. This is going to go well. After testing the blade's sharpness, he said both items in front of her. Just however... Okay, that's fair. Yeah, be careful. Okay, I'll try my best. Okay. That's fair. I'm moving so stiffly I can't cut very well. Didn't he just teach me how to do it? Put it at an angle to move forward and back. Oh, it's stuck. I can't move it. What do I do? Uh, don't, don't pull it out too fast. I'll tell you that much. She looked up seeking assistance, but Carmia's back was turned to her. I'll just start by taking it out. Calm down, calm down. Ah! Yes, I just nicked my finger a little. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Oh dear, he's, uh, he's, he might be having a little bit of a panic. Huh? Right now? Oh, I'm fine. It's not that bad. It's like, your entire finger's been cut off! It's fine! Robin-sensei! <laughs> Mr. Carmia, could you run a little slower? Yes. Dude, breathe. It's fine. It's a cut. Guys, it, it just bandage. Okay, breathe. Thank you. He's that worried. It's
<laughs> mm. Anyway. <laughs> And now we're just uh, talking about. Ooh. Does that include you as well, Mr. Carmine? Hmm. Yeah, that is a good question. Why is it that you let um, Kiri boss you around? You're the Dawn. I mean, he's good at what he's doing, but at the same time, if he's being a jackass, just saying. Oh, it's Heidi. Hello, Heidi. And then we start talking about the meteor shower, if I recall. Oh, the meteor shower gathering. And then she's gonna wish for something very special, and then we're just like, I don't know. I'm just kind of here, and I'm. it's a new thing for me. I'm just kind of here. I'm just going to check it out and see where it goes. I don't know. I'm just kind of here. And I guess we will, much like with the, uh, the, the first thing, we'll save off here. And we'll continue onward with the meteor shower, because after that is when we start getting into the romance stuff. So, ho, ho, ho. We'll be touching on that in the next episode. But for now, this is Star Princess HLC saying thank you very much for watching and have a fond farewell.